I mean, yeah, the that's the thing though. The boards were already good. You just got to find the right fin sometimes. It's not a long board. It's not your standard mid length, and then it's not a regular fish either. It's kind of a real blend of a few different things. I'm Blake Peters, the owner and shaper of Panda Surfboards. I'm originally from Australia, now based in Costa Mesa, California. Ah, uh, this is a Panda. I believe it's a Twinzer. Twin fin with little side bites in the front. Twin with two little uh, canard fins in front of the twins. So it's actually a quad. So it's not a quad, it's a Twinzer. No, I never rode on. But yeah, this was something I guarantee he'd never ridden before. And I knew no one else was gonna shape a Twinzer, so I thought this was perfect. I don't like the fins. One of the guys told me that Noah was riding it and it was looking too long. It's like, it, cause it's like, feels a little too thick for me. And so I just messaged Noah to see how he was going with it. I can't push it because the fins, are, these fins are kind of stiff. Like I might try the red ones in it. He said he tried it and it felt too stiff and it shouldn't feel stiff. Anyway, he changed the fins up luckily and thought about it and put some softer flexier fins in. And then as soon as I put these red fins in, the same ones, it went so much better. And all of a sudden the thing became the way it should be. And he told me he was doing airs on it, which it's totally not made for. It'd be a board where like, if you had a heap of time to like, just go down the line and just try turns out, you'd, I think it'd feel like you'd really get in a rhythm with it. And that's why it works. Because it is an extreme, which is how you should make boards so that they work. Keeping it simple, like keeping it flat, keeping it thin in the tail, it's all stuff that works. I mean, if you want to go extreme and fucking get pissed off by your board, but I just like riding shit that goes. I don't know how it looks, but it feels like it goes to me. Thankfully, he thought about the type of fin, put them in, and it completely changed the board. It enabled him to throw it around and do what he wanted on it. And since then, I've totally changed a few things in this design but sometimes it takes guys like that open up your mind and think about it a little differently knowing how Noah wrote it it's not necessarily how it's meant to be written.